Hi, this is Jerome Fryer, and I'm just moving along with uh, Stuart McGill's back mechanic self-assessment. We've gone over pain with spine flexion, pain with dynamic loading, pain with neck flexion, and how about pain with compression? So pain with compression talks about pain with holding loads in front of you or when opening a window, for example. So what he talks about here is that if you look here, here's a lumbopelvic model, and you can see that the discs actually lie, these intervertebral discs, lie quite back of the human body. The, you know, the stomach should be here somewhere, right? maybe not out here, but should be here somewhere. And you can see that these discs actually kind of live on the back side of someone's body. So when you go to reach, for example, a little bit too far, that will create more bending forward. and It'll put more stress further forward on these discs, which pushes the nucleus, which is the material on the inside, it pushes it back. So you can see in this model here, if you, if you keep the spine in relative neutral, let's do it this way here, but if you keep the spine in relative neutral, the, the nucleus inside doesn't go backwards at all, but if the, the further you create load away, the more this thing has to bend. You see that? So the closer the load comes into the spine, the more the, 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 the force comes down through this region rather than kind of putting it further over this way. So if you bend forward and you go, and he talks about um, opening a window, for example, or loads in front of you, you can see here that when you load it, the nucleus can push back. And you can get a little, there's a nerve root that, that travels right along there that it can bump into. And uh, you see here the nerve roots, right? So if you bend forward, you can see how it just bumps right into that nerve root, which can cause symptoms of leg pain. So that's with compression. Right, so bending forward and you're and you're grabbing something and you're creating some compression. So, of course, he talks about, you know, you want to avoid this. So you want to give this tissue on the back of the disc, this tissue right in here, right where that red spot is. It's like a cut on the on the skin or anywhere else. You got to give it a chance to heal. So you want to kind of avoid that. So the tissue has an opportunity to, to heal over. And uh, so important little anatomical sort of insight why it may hurt when you place loads on your spine way out in front of you. Mm -hmm.